it will be recalled that in March, we had gone to Washington to discuss the various issues that were troubling the Belizean public um, in relation to activities at the Sastoon River. And at that time, after discussion with the uh, Guatemalan counterpart, um, <clears throat> we had agreed that we will try to meet as quickly as possible after the Easter vacation to try to further the discussion. So this meeting was with a view to doing that. And at the same time, we decided that we would, in fact, try to deal with other issues which we have on a bilateral basis between the two countries. We are here today to continue building a new relation between Guatemala and Belize. <clears throat> Minister Erlington and Myself, Minister Morales, we are aware that uh, we have a goal, and the goal is to have the best relation between both countries. We know we have a differendum, and the differendum has to be sent to the International Court of Justice. Uh, but in the meantime, we have, to, we have to build a very good relation between both countries, and we, and we have to avoid any kind of incidents between both countries. This is the most important. We have a very good neighborhood, and the idea is to work together because we're going to be neighbors forever. Uh, definitely, there are many challenges to face, but uh, we have the goodwill to continue working together. Uh, and well, we will, we, we will have these kind of meetings. We are having these kind of meetings. We just instruct but the joint commission that are led by the Ambassador Roldan and Ambassador Rosado to continue with the works to strengthen the bilateral relation and in the in the implementation of the of the 13 bilateral agreements. Uh, we are working very hard. I am very happy because General uh, Perez, who is the chief commander of the Guatemalan Army, is here with uh, General Jones talking about the this bilateral relation and how come we can avoid any kind of incidents.